you're actually on all the time. Every every word, every word. Come on, every word. <laughs> I know it's scary at first when you hear that. It's when I think, I don't, oh my god, what did I say? What did I do? <laughs> yeah. And that's usually what I see in the audience. It, you know something? It's strange sitting down talking. I, I I'm used to used to standing. <laughs> Oh, well, everything changes, right? Yeah, it does. <laughs> this is a virtual reality. Yeah. That's something you want to understand. This is a virt not a re not reality, but a virtual reality. Now, in reality, nothing changes. Yeah. But in a virtual reality, everything changes. In fact, it, not only it goes away completely. Yeah. <laughs> so, so why get all upset about having values on things that... Phew, Eventually, just go away if you don't go first. <laughs> That's true. What's really important? That's what you want to know. What is really important to me to be happy? Yeah. And to be happy, it's a choice. What is you given choose this day? Why not choose to be happy? Yeah. It, it doesn't cost you anything. You don't have to tell anyone. You 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 don't have to no no special anything just be happy and you have to choose it i'm telling you you have to choose to because I tell you, just listening to what's going on in the world is is that that's enough absorption of negativeness yeah. so you have to counter that by not listening to all that nonsense and see they'll say well you've got to know what's going on you're going on that's what's happening Look at that. Find out what that means. <laughs> Another good idea. It actually is a good idea. And you know what I find? Most of the news that I don't hear, there's always somebody willing to share with me what's going on. You know, and most of it, the truth of the matter is, if we're going to be honest, we can't change or nothing really in our life really is impacted or changed by knowing what happened, you know, across the country or on the other side of the world. A lot of times what it does for me is just kind of get me upset because of course now my heart's broken from what it is that I saw on TV. Yeah, that's it. That's it. You let somebody else set your mood. Yeah. See, if you're not in charge of setting your own, look, that's what we're here for. We have one purpose to be, and that is to direct our self-talk. And, and and talking out loud, uh, and that's not generally really who you are, because you know, it's like, oh, so glad to meet you. You know, I, 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 I. <laughs> oh, what a know it all. <laughs> no, as a matter of fact, I haven't plumbed the depth of anything. And thank God that I haven't plumbed the depth of it. I mean, there's more and more and more. And there's so much more being offered to you every day, every day, this day. So much more offered than you're taking advantage of. Isn't that true? It is true. I don't even think the truth of the matter is the majority of us, I can't even imagine what's being offered. And even if we took just a portion of it, it would so satisfy us to our wildest dreams so no nobody can it says that man it, it hasn't entered into the mind or the thoughts of men the things that the divine god within has prepared for us so no we have uh, no clue but he has said prepared for you yeah it's always prepared yeah. are you ready yeah see that's see the, eventually the hunger will come upon you I don't know in what time slot. I don't know how many I've had. <laughs> time slot. Because there's nothing transforming in death, we're told. Yeah. Nothing. In other words, you, you die ding dong, you get to play ding dong again. It's just that simple. And you know what you are, so that's what you'll be doing. What you leave with is what you start with. And and scripture makes this very clear. So, I, and I, I applaud those people who are at 90 and 100 years old going to college and and you see because they they somehow know that that's not the end. And it isn't. It isn't an end. 
and it isn't rest in peace either. <laughs> Not unless you took it with you. <laughs> but you have to take it with you to, to, to experience it there too. Because if you don't take it with you, you won't have it. And you have to still get it. But it is still with you always. This day. It's always this day. Never yesterday or tomorrow. It's always this day. And that's when you're to choose this day, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, you said that uh, there's nothing transforming in death. And it's so true. I don't know if you've ever looked at a, a small baby. And you can see in that small baby, even in the first few days, certainly the first few weeks, attitude starting to form. You know, some children are just so sweet and loving and others aren't. You know, you know, I'm, I'm being honest, you know, some children aren't. But you can almost see their personality almost immediately. Actually, you can form their personality even before they're born because they're listening to you and what's going on around you. That's true. So it's being made up for him before he's even born. You see, that's what we are as parents. We're supposed to guide the child. Another place I fail. But you, you, know, you, know, you know you're on course if they're happy. Yeah. And that, that, that's all it really takes is just for them to be happy. That doesn't mean, that doesn't mean spoil them. Yeah. No. I mean, a little bit. It's okay a little bit. But they, they have attitudes also. Or almost immediately. Really... And, and, and when you see the attitudes being portrayed that are not to their benefit, then, then that it's your job immediately to, 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 to kind of change their mind and change their world, but through j just being. Yeah. You, you see, you have to be the thing you want them to be. Because if you're not, they perceive more than what you're saying. <laughs> they, they're receiving tele, telecommunication with the brain. Hey, I know it's a vegetable brain, but boy, it's a powerful sucker. <laughs> and, 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 and you're given to use it and use it wisely. Since you're always thinking ahead of your evidence. Not, not to be in charge of what you're thinking about. That, that could be anything from uncomfortable to disastrous. But, and, and just think about it. I, I'd rather you think from it, but think about it for a while and maybe you'll start thinking from it. Yeah, it's true. That, that's what I did. I thought about it for years before I actually pressed to enter in. And that means you're thinking feelingly about Dream the dream. Isn't that what we're told to do? And, and, and if you're not dreaming a dream, you, you're dying. That's what it says. When you, when you fail to dream, you start to die. So then the moods are very important, aren't they? Absolutely. So why wouldn't you choose a good mood? Why, why would you let somebody else change your mood? And it happens all the time. You know, you see somebody, oh, hi, how are you? And then they didn't have a good morning or, or good night or whatever. And it, yeah, okay. And so right away, see, and and a smile does so much. I mean, what what makes what makes it a, a little baby so so beautiful is smile, because they give you a smile. It's just it's a real smile. It's not a pretense. It's real. See, people don't understand. They're all actors. You act out what you're thinking, feelingly in the mind, in imagination before you ever do it. You were speaking about us all being actors. You know, you talked about a baby smile. And of course, then actually, that's what Shakespeare told us. Yeah. The whole, whole vast world is just a stage. And all the men and women are merely actors. And that's true. You're acting out in mind what you plan to do. Yeah. I mean, it's that simple. You're thinking in mind. But you see, if you're thinking these thoughts, and you think, well, okay, I'm only thinking it. <laughs> but only thinking it is like, think only on things that are lovely and of good report. You see, if you're going to use the only, use it there. 
you were talking about the think only, you know, and it goes back to, of course, the lovely and the good report. But people don't understand the power of even what they perceive to be an idle thought. But Jesus thought it was so important that he said that you would even give an account for even your idle thoughts. And basically what he's saying is idle thoughts also show up in your life. Yeah. 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 You experience it. Yeah. And and what you're experiencing it, if you could trace the dots back to when you thought that thought, but you see, that's man's poor memory. You see, Neville told us over and over, man, man's biggest problem is just poor memory. He's agreeing with it today, but he forgot all about it yesterday, tomorrow. You see, that that was my that was my problem. I couldn't remember down the line. And so when when it's not in mind, it's 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 actually gone. You you have you can draw it up. You see, like someone says, Well, well, let me think about it for a while. Well, see, so you can draw up a different idea. And and that's all you have to do is just draw up a different idea. Think only on things that are lovely and of good report. Now, look, I know, I know you're not aware all the time. We're, we're aware of that because we're, we're forgiving ourselves moment by moment, actually, because we understand the idea of forgiving yourself because you can't be forgiven. It starts with you. It all starts with you. You turn to me. I'll turn to you, God says. So it starts with you. You, you have to do the turning. It is only the one turning. See? So he can't help you until you help yourself, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. I, I'm trying to think of other ways to say in the same thing. That's what it takes, isn't it? Over and over and over. It is repetition over and over and over again. And the thing is, the thing we don't know when it's going to click for the other person. You know, so our job is to give the information and let the seeds fall where they may. That's right. In other words, it's your message. Yeah. We're not we're not giving you anything. We we're just sharing with you your own message. Now, what you do with it, that's your business. It's not, that's not my business, that's your business. That are you minding your business? That's that's a question. I mean, and that's a serious question. Are you minding your business? In other words, do you know what you're talking to yourself about, suggesting to yourself morning, noon, and night? Because if you don't, then you, you're just lost in thought most of the time. And, and that's not a good place. It really isn't a good place to be lost in thought because that could be anything from uncomfortable to disastrous. And, and, and you don't need that. Yeah. Clear thinking, that's what you need. But... To think clearly, you have to you have to relax. <laughs> you see, if you're all tense about something, then you may sh do the hollering and shouting and all of that, but you're still not in control. <laughs> and that's what you want. You want control, but you have give it has been given to you in the simple message of choose this day. If you can't choose a new mood, if you can't choose to be happy, then you're denying yourself because God's not denying you anything. He, he told you, I'm not denying you anything. It's all yours. Choose it. And, and Emmett Fox wrote a, a whole book on claim. That's what you're to do. You're to claim it. It's yours, but you have to claim it. It's an inheritance, but you still have to claim it, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. And the claim is us giving our attention, turning to what it is that we desire. That's the claim, you know, so whatsoever, give your attention to whatsoever purposely. Yeah, well, look, if, if, you're not, if you're not choosing what you're thinking, then who's choosing it? Absolutely. See, in other words, your environment, all the people around you, they all have opinions and they all want to give them to you too. Absolutely. And yeah, I have opinions too. Someone says, what your opinion on this? Or, no, 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 no. Th this is not the place for my opinions. This, th I'm delivering to you your message. This isn't about me. This isn't about De Carlo. Absolutely. I mean, he's a handsome fellow, but it isn't about him either. <laughs> attitude, attitude, attitude. That's what it's about. What is your attitudes? About generally anything. Because the thing of it is, 
if you have a couple of bad attitudes, they 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 tend to multiply. You see, in other words, they have children too, <laughs> and you'll experience them too. So, be careful. Watch what you're saying. That's the best. Give you just watch what you're yeah. saying, which is plenty. You know, as far as to watch what you say, but that's the challenge. Even with a bad attitude, what I come to realize, you know, in my few years on this planet is that most people aren't aware of their bad attitude. They're they not even aware of thinking. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it true? It is true. I mean, that's that that's who those guys, those criminals are looking for, the people who aren't paying attention. See, if you if you look active, they're gonna think, nah, maybe you know, that's like the lions, man. They'll lay there and they'll let they'll let a thousand go by, but they'll want that they see that one who's lagging a little or limping or falling behind, and that's it. That's dinner today. That's true. And so are our thoughts, you know. So we have to be mindful. We talked about advertisers and everyone else. When you're not managing your thinking, your thoughts, your words, your deeds, somebody else is going to do it. When you can't do it, as Mr. Linda will often say, somebody else is going to do it for you. Oh, yeah. They're waiting in the wings. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> waiting for that mistake. Hold on. It's very, I make a lot of mistakes, but sometimes I don't get caught on it, I guess. I must because I know one attack. Yeah. It's all about our attitude. It's just about life in general. I mean, what is you just when you sit down and think, what is what is my attitude about life in general? Because see, that's what we're trying to do here. We're in general giving you your message that you can change your mind and change your world. And and that that's what I understand everybody's looking for is how to cause desired change, isn't it? Absolutely. That's exactly. I mean, people are paying literally trillions of dollars to bring about desired change. Weight loss, relationships, money, whatever. That's what people are paying for is desired change. Right here. Yeah. The changes are right here. All the changes you want to make are right here. All you have to do is bring them forward. And all you have to do to bring them forward is to focus on them. And because what, like I said, what has your attention has your life. And if you're thinking on the things that will have your life ahead of now, well, that's the whole idea, isn't it? It is. I, I mean, who, who's making up your, your itinerary? Who's, who's choosing for you? See, if you're not choosing, then the world around you is choosing for you. Now, if that's okay with you, fine. Yeah. If they're treating you nice, good. Yeah, great. But if they're not, change your mind, change your world. It's that simple. And if you keep it that simple, and that's what we started out saying, keep it simple, stupid, or whatever <laughs> he said. Smarty. But that's the, I got it. I got it that way. <laughs> keep it simple, stupid. Because I, I yeah. Well, that's how I got it, too. In the uh, basic training <laughs> in the Marine Corps, you know, and so you hear it so much pretty soon. I was verbalizing that and I had to catch myself, you know, when I was in the military because that's how we got it, you know, but that's how it stuck. Also, when you think about the kiss, you know, keeping it simple, it sticks, you know, so then you go back and, you know, IBM had a, a slogan years ago, think, just simply think, you know, so yeah, simple slogans work best. Yep. And and actually, we know that. Yeah. We do know that. And, and why do we avoid sitting in the silence? Because we don't want to hear what we're going to hear. Okay. Because it means there has to be change. Absolutely. And, and change is very difficult for people. I, I mean, it's like a last resort. <laughs> Someone says, well, yeah, I'll get into that later. But you see, when later shows up and it says, are we ready now? And you see, later. Yeah. But that's you denying yourself. Because it's with you right here, right now. And how do I know? Because God's with you. 
He says, I'm with you always. I will never leave you. I'm not present. I mean, how can you break that down and he's not with you? That's true. So if he's with you, he says, talk to me. Isn't that what he says? Absolutely. Talk to me? Absolutely. Well, why wouldn't you talk to him? What are you going to church for? You're going to church to do all of those things so you really don't have to talk to God. They'll get me through. Yeah. I'll go with that group. Yeah. It's one by one. It doesn't take a group. It's one by one. That's how you're called. Not with a group. You're on your own right there. But I'm with you, but you're on your own because you're the one choosing. This is, this is your trip. You are an explorer. Actually, everybody's an explorer. They, they don't really realize that, that they're an explorer. But it's, it's, it's exploring here, not, not, not out there. I mean, you can do that, too. That's, it's wonderful. It's, it's, it's beautiful. I've done so and seen many countries, and, and it's, it's all beautiful. But it's what you're doing in here that really, really counts in your world of experiencing, doesn't it? It is. It really is. And so as we're talking about, keep it simple, smarty, stupid, however you want to phrase it. What would you say to the listener in closing? Keep it simple, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that was my that was the final note I got. <laughs> it's true. You know, and I want to touch on, um, you know, keeping it simple. I think a lot of times people complicate this message. And so, and as Mr. Linda will often say, I think that sometimes we want it compl complicated so that we'll have an excuse out. But after listening to what's been said today, there are no excuses. No, you can't justify it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I could justify anything if I really wanted to, and so could you. Yeah. But- the thing of it is, you don't want to justify what you don't want to experience. Yeah. But if you're giving your attention to it, that is exactly what you're going to do. Experience what you don't want. Yeah. If, it, if, if it doesn't make you happy, drop it. Running off scenarios in your head about things that happened in the past if you didn't enjoy them then, what makes you think you're going to have a, a good mood or attitude if, you, if you're going over and over in your mind? Yeah. I mean, see, it, it's really common sense. Well, it, like the lady said, it's not really all that common anymore, common sense. But it is there, and it is for you to uh, assume the a position of better than the best yet and that's all you have to do. As long as you keep getting it better, you'll be happy. But if you're not, then that drags you back into where you don't want to be. Let it go. Let it go. That's, that's man's biggest problem. He will not let go of past experiences that they weren't even happy then. And yet he runs them off in his mind every day and he wonders why he feels bad. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. I uh we can both probably count several people on our hands that uh, we interact with that continuously are playing uh, yesterday's song. They don't like the song, but they just keep replaying it. Yeah. So. Yeah. We're all conditioned. Yeah. And the idea is it's like, it's too hot and you have to take off clothing. See your life gets too warm for you and you, and you have to let things go. But that, that's, that's something that man finds very difficult. I mean, look, look at the hoarders. They, they can't let nothing go. And they, they got a use for, they got a justification for every, every. How, how do we get in these positions? Because we're not doing the thinking. We're operating on conditioning. You see, that's what it is. It's the same thing with weight gain and everything, all of that. It's, it's the way you're conditioned. And if you recondition yourself, in other words, change your mind, change your world, I mean, you're told, be you transformed by the renewing, re renewing of your mind. See, it's like, oh, I'm going to get tires for the car. I'm getting new tires. I'm not getting old tires. I'm getting new tires. Well, when you, you get new ideas. See, if a man would order his conversations right, he would be shown salvation. 
I mean, isn't that what you're looking for? Absolutely. Because you're on all the time. So it's right with you. You're alive. God's all life. You're alive. Act like it. Well, sir, like always, it's been a pleasure. Oh, yeah? I don't even have a watch. Yeah. And I got rid of my phone. <laughs> yeah, didn't hear it ring once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i tell you it, it seems I, I i don't know it seems like the, it's a magnet when yeah. we in these talks it's true it's like everybody wants to call at that moment yeah well i got things to do and places to go well <laughs> the, actually my wife will be the guide <laughs> i don't really need to go anywhere but <clears throat> seriously yeah. try and be seriously <laughs> I, I am it's difficult but try and be seriously and that doesn't mean you can't laugh yeah. as a matter of fact even god laughs god laughs yeah and he's got plenty to laugh at we give him quite a bit it, 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 he's, not, he's not judging you but he, but he does think it's funny uh, i i hope <laughs> Well, the thing of it was, if it wasn't his idea, uh, he yeah. could have canceled it all like that. Yeah. But he gave you. See, that's it. He he gave you. That's already a given. Not when you're good. He gave you. Choose to stay. What are you choosing? I mean, that's that's, that's all you have to ask. What, what are you choosing? Or are you aware that you are choosing? Because you are choosing. And, and 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 there's always trade-offs. You have to you have to consider the trade-offs because if you don't consider the trade-offs, then, then then you'll just be denying yourself even more. Absolutely. Look, what 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 you say you're suffering, you're going to suffer more. I see. The idea is is that I'm not suffering, even though I'm half the pain. I'm not suffering the pain. I'm allowing it. And I can stop allowing it, but it doesn't take immediate action because you're not wholehearted. But as you do build in confidence, as you go along doing your your thing, just contemplation and meditation, and, and don't make a big deal out of it. You're doing it all the time anyway, maybe poorly, but you, you're, you're doing it anyway. So why not just refine it? See, that's what you're here to do, to direct your attention. That that that's your that that's really your only job, isn't it? Absolutely. Feeding Absolutely. your face, feeding your face, but directing attention. <laughs> well, I'm glad we got through this. Well, yeah, we did. We did great. So, yeah, good well, stuff. Oh yeah, a little little a little here or there, a little there, or there. but uh, you can correct that. Oh, that's that's easy fix. Oh, okay, good show. Okay, I was going to. I had a question to ask you, too. We're off now, right? We will be. Give me a sec. People just want to know what you did to be successful. The four CDs that I have out there, it's all there. If you took any one of the CDs and actually followed through on what you understood there, you could change your mind, change your world. All you have to do is... Just listen to the CDs. It's always reiteration and reiteration. I want to go back to the uh, board CD set. Go to metaphysicalarttheater.com. We can only mail in the U.S. right now, but for those who are outside the U.S., we can send you a digital bundle with everything so you'll get the enjoyment without waiting for it in the mail. Matter of fact, those who are in the U.S., if you would rather have the digital copies, we can do that as well. Metaphysicalarttheater.com.